kale shakes. What's up guys? So I just woke up and I thought that I'd share with you my kale shake recipe. Now I have one of these shakes every single day. Now the reason why I started this was because I was looking at my daily food intake and I realized that I hardly get any fruits or vegetables. And the older that I get, the healthier I wanna live. So I've implemented this shake into my diet and I feel great. I look better, my body feels better, and the best part is when you take a shit, mmm, feels amazing. So here's everything that I use in my kale shakes. Now you can change this up if you like, but this is what I personally use. Oh, and I get all these ingredients from Trader Joe's because I live in Southern California and that's a cool thing to do. We got some baby kale, some spinach, some broccoli, got some ginger. You just want to use a little bit of this, a small apple, a whole banana, and some ginseng powder. Now my mom got me this, so it's real Asian, but you could probably get this online. All right, so I have a blender here, nothing special about it. And this is the order that I place my ingredients. A handful of broccoli, the cut up apple, then I add in the ginger. Now you wanna be careful of how much you put in because it could get spicy real fast. Two teaspoons of ginseng, a handful of spinach, a handful of kale, and finally, the banana. Then just add water. delicious. What's going on everyone? This is Fred, fredyen.com. And for all of you longtime subscribers, I just want to say, I'm sorry. I haven't posted a video in like a year. I've just been concentrating on other channels that I've been working on, but that's no excuse. I didn't call, I didn't write. I basically treated you like an ex-girlfriend, but I don't want that. I want you in my life. So I got some good news. I have been working on some new videos. I'm not exactly sure when they're going to be released, but I'm guessing in a couple weeks. So as always, Thanks for watching and stay tuned.